familiarization with the function generator and oscilloscope in detail. Certainly. Let's dive into a more detailed explanation of the function generator and oscilloscope. Function generator. A function generator is an electronic test equipment that generates different types of electrical waveforms. It is commonly used in various applications such as research, development, testing, and education. Function generators are versatile tools that provide precise control over waveform characteristics. Now we will discuss key features and controls of a function generator. Waveform selection. Function generators offer various waveform options, including sine wave. It produces a smooth oscillating waveform resembling a sine curve. Sine waves are used in audio applications, frequency response testing, and signal generation. Square wave. This waveform alternates between two voltage levels, typically high and low. It is commonly used in digital circuits and timing applications. Triangle wave. The triangle waveform exhibits a linear rise and fall, creating a triangular shape. It finds applications in audio testing and modulation. Sawtooth wave. This waveform has a linear rise and an abrupt fall, creating a sawtooth pattern. Sawtooth waves are useful in signal generation, synchronization, and timing applications. Frequency control. Function generators allow you to adjust the frequency of the generated waveform. You can typically set the frequency using a frequency control knob or a numeric keypad. The frequency is measured in Hertz HZ and represents the number of cycles or oscillations per second. Amplitude control. The amplitude control determines the peak-to-peak -peak voltage of the generated waveform. It allows you to adjust the output voltage level according to your requirements. The amplitude is typically measured in volts V. Offset control. The offset control adds a DC offset to the generated waveform, shifting it up or down the voltage axis. By applying an offset, you can position the waveform at a specific voltage level relative to the ground or zero reference. Duty cycle control. For square waveforms, the duty cycle control adjusts the ratio of the high and low states of the waveform. It is usually expressed as a percentage and represents the duration of the high state compared to the total period of the waveform. Oscilloscope An oscilloscope, often referred to as an oscillograph or scope, is a versatile electronic instrument used to visualize and analyze electrical waveforms. It displays voltage signals as a graph with time on the x-axis and voltage on the y-axis. Channels. Oscilloscopes can have one or more input channels, typically labeled as channel 1, channel 2, etc. Each channel allows you to connect and observe a separate signal simultaneously. Dual-channel oscilloscopes are common, enabling you to compare and analyze two signals simultaneously. Time-based control. The time-based control adjusts the time duration represented by the horizontal axis of the oscilloscope display. By changing the time-based setting, you can zoom in or out on the waveform, allowing for detailed observation or a broader view of the signal. Voltage slash vertical scale control. The voltage scale control adjusts the vertical sensitivity of the oscilloscope. It determines the number of volts represented by each vertical division on the display. By adjusting the voltage scale, you can ensure that the signal fits within the display area, making it easy to analyze the waveform's amplitude and voltage variations. Trigger control. The trigger determines when the oscilloscope starts capturing and displaying the waveform. It helps stabilize repetitive waveforms on the screen for analysis. The trigger control allows you to set the trigger level, trigger slope, rising or falling edge, and trigger source, which channel or external source to use for triggering. Cursors and measurements. Modern oscilloscopes provide various measurement features to analyze waveforms accurately. These include voltage cursors that allow you to measure the amplitude, time, and other parameters of the waveform. Additionally, 
oscilloscopes often offer automatic measurements, such as peak-to-peak -peak voltage, frequency, period, rise time, and many others. How we use function generator and oscilloscope together. To use the function generator and oscilloscope together, follow these steps. Connect the output of the function generator to the input channel of the oscilloscope using appropriate cables or connectors. Ensure that you match the output impedance of the function generator to the input impedance of the oscilloscope for optimal signal transfer. Set up the function generator to generate the desired waveform, frequency, amplitude, and any other required parameters. Configure the oscilloscope to match the signal characteristics. Set the time base, voltage scale, trigger settings, and any necessary measurement options. Start the function generator to generate the waveform. Observe the generated waveform on the oscilloscope display. You can use the oscilloscope's measurement features to analyze and measure various aspects of the waveform, such as amplitude, frequency, and timing parameters. Remember to consult the user manuals of your specific function generator and oscilloscope models for detailed instructions and additional features they may offer. It's essential to familiarize yourself with the specific controls and options provided by the equipment you are using. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoy the video, click the like icon, subscribe my channel and press bell icon for more videos.